It's the Lynch and Taco Show's The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. The highlights and, unfortunately, the lowlights that stood out this past week in the vast sea we call humanity. It's 101. One WJR Orlando's Rock Station. Oh, hey, a reminder, uh, voting's open if you want to get into uh, uh, the JR Facebook page and uh, throw a vote in for You Say We Play It this morning. Uh, another pair of uh, Pantera tickets up for grabs for someone who votes. Yeah, you know it's Pantera tickets when I'm getting texts over here saying, hey, when does the uh, play the, you play the song thing <laughs> go up? Right, yeah. You Say It, We Play It is up now, JR, our Facebook page. Just vote once. Yeah, it's, uh, Godsmack's the featured artist this morning. Tell us which Godsmack tune to play at night. Just, yeah, vote one time and you'll be in the running for the Pantera tickets. All right, let's rip the band aid off with the bad stuff first, right? Oh, okay. Another school shooting yesterday at uh, Perry Middle and High School uh, near Des Moines, Iowa. 17 year old student uh, who ended up uh, killing himself. After the incident, uh, after killing a sixth grader and injuring five others. I always hate hearing these stories, man. There's more and more of them. Pablo Pintueles Hernandez, 64 year old from Lehigh Acres, arrested and charged with false imprisonment uh, of a child 13 years old and under as he tried to abduct a four year old at Walmart in Southwest Florida. Oh, I saw a video of that mm-hmm. up on the news. In Grabbing here. the kid by the arm, trying to. Yeah. And yeah. then the mom comes out yep. from the side. Thank God. Scumbag. You hope geez, that he gets his in prison. Clay Kinney from uh, Geneva um, had a suspended license and was arrested for running over a deer and posting the video of him doing it on TikTok. Wow. Arrested on five counts of animal torment, one count of animal torture, and one count of moving of a moving traffic violation. Uh, when he was pinched by the police in, uh, in the conversation, he did admit to running over the, the deer. Uh, in fact, for, for a TikTok video, he uh, uh, originally was attempting to run over a group of five deer, but was only able to hit the one with his car. You're, you're a tough guy, dude. So, obviously, animal lover or just a normal human being saw it and reported it to FWC, I'm guessing, then good. Uh, We go down to Palm Springs, which is in uh, Palm Beach County. Guy is filling up at a uh, Cumberland Farms gas station on New Year's Day right around noon. Okay. Some dude just comes flying out of nowhere and begins attacking and stabbing him. That would be 43-year-old Jose Miranda. He's behind bars after attacking the stranger for God knows what reason while he was filling up at the gas station on New Year's Day. You can't even fill your car up now without, you know. Not the way to start the new year. Pamela Rodriguez. The gas prices are already killing, you know. Pamela Rodriguez. uh, This woman's out of Connecticut. Uh, She had her car stolen, and she wanted the police to... uh, promptly try to find it so of course she told them that her kid was in the car when it was stolen okay problem is no there was no kid in the stolen car so this huge police response trying to track down and find a kid who had been abducted inside of the car that had been stolen no kid Florida man uh, arrested after allegedly hiding and planning to marry an out-of-state teen. Did you hear about this character in Marion County? What is it? Thomas Ebersol arrested this week. Uh, he met this uh, this oh my god this sixteen-year-old girl from Ohio. Uh, I guess they were online gaming, World of Warcraft, or role-playing, whatever mm-hmm. the hell. He drives to Ohio and gets her. Brings her back to Donellan, and his plan was to hide her and eventually marry her when she was legal. Yeah, he's thirty-one. You sicko. Sixteen. Another uh, New Year's mishap. Guy uh, on a uh, Bronx subway platform New Year's Day was uh, badly beaten and stabbed after wishing four strangers a. Happy New Year. All right, we got to get some good news going here, man. <sighs> Happy New Year. Eh, that's that's a stabbing. You got a Lakeland nurse accused of fatally poisoning her neighbor's pet cats and pregnant chihuahua. 
I wonder what she's doing with her patients. Mm-hmm. What did she say the reason? 51-year-old oh, Tamisha Knighton. Is it because they're pooping in your yard? Or? I have no idea. All right, I'll give you a couple of good ones, and uh, you can get to opening up the uh, Good News Network there. I'm just cranking her open now. It's funny, on my computer, when I type in good, it just pops up right away. Did I mention this update this week earlier? The uh, Burger King employee who had worked for 27 years straight at the Burger King in the Las Vegas airport without missing a day of work. Remember him? Yeah. And they gave him that bag full of trinkets as a thanks just did they did somebody set up a GoFundMe? they did or set up a GoFundMe that ended up uh, going up to almost four hundred fifty thousand dollars the update is that guy's name is kevin ford used uh, that money to buy his very own home his first place that he's owned uh 850 square feet he goes it's not a mansion but it's mine that's and then awesome then it, it gets even better then he turned around and used some of the money to also buy his sister a home to live in. Pretty sweet. Yeah. You love hearing stories like that. Little white dog in Oklahoma got attacked by two coyotes, and a cat saved its life. The oh, do- really? The dog's name is Oakley. Attacked the uh, coyotes attacked the dog in the owner's backyard and pinned him down, but the family's black cat named Binks ran in and chased him off. Get him, Binks! All right, get ready for some pals coming your way, folks. Just saw a text come in. I'd like to hear your pals, Taco. All right, let's see. It's, it's for emphasis only. Do you, do you, did you did hear what I said, though, right? When I type in good, just the word good in my Google search, News Network pops up right after well, it. That's based on your previous. I know. Research. You know why? Because that's a pal. Uh, oh, check this out. A mysterious secret Santa motivated students, Pat. To raise money to give it to those in need, right? So some secret Santa motivated these. I'm talking young students. The look at this girl looks about probably seven years old. They raised eight thousand dollars, give to people in need. How much did the secret Santa contribute? I don't know. Uh, oh, but I know this. Pow! I know that this baby right here had spinal surgery while in the womb, and now guess what? She can walk and even run. As a baby, while she's in the womb, I don't know how they do that without bursting the the you know the vaginal or what's the fluids the you know the placenta fluids. But man, this little girl walking, running baby inside of mama. No, no, had the surgery Excuse inside. For, Excuse for a minute. Here. Had hold on the baby. You know, was preborn, very preemie probably had surgery while in the womb now that young toddler can well i guess it's just a young kid can run and walk because i've never seen a toddler run but pow oh this is good i know you're a dog lover and there's many others out there we have a golden retriever guess what this golden retriever is nursing a beer (laughs) oh it's a golden retriever no Uh it's nursing three African painted dog pups at an Indiana zoo after their mother abandoned them. So you look at this mom, she's laying, it's kind of cool. They have her in like, you know, those plastic pools that like little kids used to use. You know what I'm talking about, right? Sure. They have the golden retriever laying in there on her side with her nipples hanging out, you know? It's almost like penthouse for dogs. That's a magazine with nude ladies in it for those of you that are younger. Anyway, uh, a guy in a wheelchair came up with it. Um, so anyway. No, that's Larry Flint and Hustler. A uh, Hustler, same yeah, thing, man. different beavers. Anyway, so this golden retriever, which rhymes with beaver, is laying in a blue pool, kitty pool, nips hanging out, nursing all these little baby golden retrievers. And then you look and there's three little... Um, African painted dog pups in there. Pow, pow, pow. We got three pounds for all three of them, dog, them pups. <sighs> More dog news. A hero dog. You ready for this one? Wakes up owners after sensing fire across the street. Why did it wake up the owners? Because it was a bark unlike any other herd before. You know, you hear that annoying dog and your neighbor that goes, woof, 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 woof. This one did a different one, like, wow, it probably like a pow woof. Uh, okay, that was a stretch uh, with the pow and the woof. But, um, oh, remember the horrible fires in, uh, in, um, you know, over in Hawaii, right? Yeah, yeah Maui. Yeah, well, Maui Jewelry Store, uh, this guy, he's restoring jewelry damaged by the wildfires for absolutely free. Isn't that pretty cool? 
Um, and on to more jewelry news. A man finds largest colorless diamond in Arkansas State Park's modern history. This son of a gun in the palm of your hand, it's big. It's like you look at it and just go, oh, that's expensive. Pow! Dog nipple size. Uh, I totally. <laughs> in the blue pool, hustler. Larry Flint would be proud. He's still kicking? Well, not kicking, but is he still alive? Is he still rolling? <laughs> Larry. Did Larry? I think uh-huh. Flint might have kicked. Anyway, <laughs> then we have a... Um, the, the penthouse guy, by the way, was Bob Gucci. Yeah, yeah, somebody. Yeah. Um, we have this this <laughs> mob of high school kids, and you hear mob of high school kids, you think bad, right? No, not this mob of high school kids. They weren't a flash mob where you do some dumb dance with a bunch of other people. This was just a mob of them. It's a small pack, like dogs. Sure. Uh, they hoisted um, a car that had run over a mother and two kids. They hoisted the car up, and it's like all these kids, high school kids, run over, lift the car, and the mother and two kids escape. So, pow! Okay. You done? That's what we're going to end on, man, because that's a good. Uh, just get that visual of Golden the dog. Retriever nipples in the plastic pool. Laying in the plastic yes. pool. The kid running in the womb. <laughs> it's not running in the womb, it's. Commercial free workday rock walk, <laughs> thankfully, coming up next. Linton Taco on demand. Download the iHeartRadio app.